Hi, Lori. Uh, I just wanted to respond to your post. Um, I really liked your social uh, justice blog video here. Um, I really love the, the wellness and integrity that you speak of. I think it's important that everyone um, is treated with integrity and has the ability to get well. And um, you also talked about the counselors having a love of wanting to help others. And I think that that's mainly why we're getting a helping profession. It is to serve and it is to um, have a desire to help other people because maybe we've experienced some situations where we needed help. and it's important that we can reach out to others and, and share a testimony of faith and what we've been through and our experience and our hope. And um, I think that, you know, you really talked about that people do lose hope. I mean, we live in a pretty messed up place right now. I mean, there's so many things going on, so much hate and violence, and um, there's not a lot of integrity and there's not a lot of wellness um, that's seen in the social classes that I deal with anyways. So there is a loss of hope and uh, being a counselor and being able to reach people and bring wellness to them, we can give them uh, hope through our testimony. And so the scripture that I chose to share with you concerning this is in Romans 15, 13. It says, may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing so that by the power of the Holy Spirit, you may abound in hope. And so we can see here that it requires the Holy Spirit of God to allow us to share hope. And I really think that um, when we allow the Holy Spirit to speak to us, you know, uh, we can share with uh, clients what they need to get healing and to be well, and they can experience the hope in Jesus Christ that we have. So thank you very much. Blessings.